Alright guys, as I grind the NHL 18 versus leaderboards to end this year's game, it's become ever more evident to me that you need to be able to score pretty much every way possible um, when it comes to playing top players. So today I'm going to show you a pretty simple one that uh, can pretty much beat any passive player that skill zones. This is the goal line backhand glitch on those sleeves 12. Alright guys, so let's get right into it. The reason why this is actually a glitch goal is because the CPU goaltender will make a move and once he makes that move, then it's an easy goal. So basically how you do it is you come in from the left or the right and this can be done coming in on a breakaway as well. It's just much easier for the example to be done on the goal line and like I mentioned earlier in the intro, if someone is skill zoning and playing passive in the boards, this is a really easy way because he's playing in front of the net looking to block cross creases and not this. What you want to do is take your player, he's got to be on his off wing, which is going to be normal no matter what because, you know, you've already got off set and wings, hopefully, and you hold the backhand. And once you hold the backhand, you skate in towards the goalie. Once you get about three or four feet away, let go of the backhand deke. I'm not saying go to forehand, just let go of backhand deke and then he'll move off his post, backhand again, and you can just shoot at top shelf. It is a little awkward to do for the first little while, so I'm gonna show you how I mastered it. Boys, I'm gonna make this as clear as I possibly can. If you wanna get better at this game, and you're not taking advantage of practice mode, you're missing out. All of these goals, it is very hard to practice them in a game if you don't already have them mastered, or at least spent some time 15 minutes tops this is all i did yesterday on stream for like 10 to 15 minutes just to make sure i had it down because like i said it is a little bit of an awkward movement it's holding the backhand and then letting go of basically of the thumbstick and then back to backhand while watching the goaltender to practice that in game is a lot more difficult because you have defenders and other players chasing you and in the way it's just not an effective way to learn guys go into practice mode 10 to 15 minutes you're going to learn an easy goal that will help you immensely when it comes to playing better players and even the weaker ones because they have no idea it's coming and again anyone that skill zones this is a super effective way uh, and all you have to do is watch the goalie and time it right because once he comes off the post that's it you have a goal so guys again just go to practice mode and try it out all right and like I said, you can also use this goal while coming in on a breakaway that's slightly to the left or the right. Again, the only thing that's tough to learn and get used to is holding the backhand and then letting go of the thumbstick. You'll see it here. You just hold it, let go for a second, go back to the backhand, and he's off his post and it's an easy goal. Here's one last look from the other side around the goal line. Notice close, guys. He's up against the post. I'm going to freeze it here. The second that he comes off the post is when you go back to the backhand right here and it's wide open, it's in the net, there's nothing that can be done. It's a super easy goal that you guys should be taking advantage of, so I thought that I would uh, kind of explain it in great detail, but it is an awkward one to learn, um, so it should help you guys out once you guys have gotten it down. So guys, if you want to see me use this stuff in action, I stream on Twitch, uh, www.twitch.tv slash nosleeves12 every morning from about 9 a.m. Eastern time till about noon, um, pretty much Monday to Friday. And uh, like I said, lately I've just been trying to grind the versus leaderboards, trying to get in the top 100. I hadn't played really at all throughout the season, so I thought, what, uh, why, why not try it now? But uh, yeah, I hope this guy, I hope this helps, guys. Hit me with a like or subscribe, bang the comment section, let me know if you've tried it and it works. And uh, yeah, you guys stay sweet.